that due to adverse weather conditions at Wellington Airport, there are no more seats left to Wellington tonight or tomorrow. We ask those customers who reside in Auckland to please return home and contact reservations on 0800 737 000. Good morning, it is a day three in Dunedin, so our last in the city today, and I'm quite sad, I really like it here. I'm not sure what we've got planned for today. I was hoping that we'd go down to Tunnel Beach, but the weather isn't that great, so we'll probably give that a miss. We're going to check out soon, and then drive around, find a place that has gluten-free breakfast. Um, hopefully Maldex will be open, so that it'll be good to go back, because... Holy shit, those wedges and nachos that we had on Friday were delicious. I am pretty tired today. Got to sleep at about 1.30. I'm usually in bed way earlier than that, so. And my nose is all blocked. I think my hay fever's been set off because we were around a lot of plants and flowers and trees and stuff yesterday, so there was all the stuff at the um, railway station when we were there yesterday morning and then Lanark Castle had a massive garden and so yeah my nose is just stuffy I think my eyes look a bit red as well so it's just like ugh hey fever you suck hopefully we'll do something exciting I just had a look at the Otago Museum and that looks kind of cool it's free they have more bones like an actual put together skeleton which would be kind of cool to see and they also have mummies. That's one thing I miss about the Wellington Museum, like the old museum. Before we check out, I'll start off with a little outfit of the day and show you guys what I'm wearing. So this is what I'm wearing today. I'm wearing my cardigan from yesterday that I got from Cotton On, the t-shirt that I got from Cotton On, ponty pants that I got from Glassons and socks because I haven't put my shoes on but they'll be the boots that I got from Gubs because they're comfortable and they're one of the really only pairs of shoes that I wear and also they're the only waterproof pairs of shoes that I own. Due to adverse weather conditions at Wellington Airport, 
there are no more seats left to Wellington tonight or tomorrow. We ask those customers who reside in Auckland to please return home and contact reservations on 0800 737 Hey guys, so we are in Auckland for the night. Our flight from Dunedin to Wellington currently and so it was diverted to Auckland. Um, we're staying at the Langham and managed to rebook a flight for 8.45 a.m. in the morning so hopefully we get a couple of hours of sleep here and then head back to the, ho the hotel and then head back to the airport. I am so exhausted right now and I am hoping that our flight tomorrow will be able to land. Apparently the fog in Wellington isn't supposed to clear until about 9 a.m. But I also saw that a flight landed this evening, so that should be alright. They put on a couple of extra flights um, to Wellington from Auckland because we would have been here until Tuesday otherwise, which wouldn't have been so bad because I could have caught up with a friend, but it's so good. It's time to rest and then get going. Good morning, it is 6 and we've just gotten up and are getting dressed and ready to go to the airport because our flight is at 8.45 this morning and we need to be there at... Eight. Sorry, I'm so tired. I don't really have much of a good sleep last night, and so I'm just hella exhausted right now. Yeah, so get ready, have some coffee, head to the airport, hopefully grab something to eat, and then make our way back to Wellington. Yay! <laughs> I am really glad that I prepare for the worst possible situation, so I have like clothes and stuff to wear, which is good. Um, yeah, it's time to get to get getting ready, repack the bag, and then head off to the airport. Just got dressed, had coffee, and brushed our teeth, washed my face. Um, so I thought that I'd give you a quick outfit of the day. Sorry, I'm so tired. If I lose my train of thought, it's because I've not had much sleep this weekend. Alright, anyway, cardigan from Cotton On, striped top from Maru, um, glattened ponty pants, and boots from Gabs. And I think we've got everything packed, so now about to start heading home again. Attempt two at getting back into Wellington. now and holy shit this car feels like a sauna it's a bit cloudy but definitely not as bad as it would have been yesterday it's quite sunny in Wellington actually I think I've got third wind because now I'm like overtired wide awake so glad I didn't have a coffee on the flight because I've already had two today oh so yeah now we're headed home and I don't know, I'm in between wanting to stay away forever and wanting to sleep for a week. Pretty lucky that we're ridiculously on time um, when it comes to getting to airports because the flight that we were meant to be on 
was cancelled and so we would have been stuck in Dunedin which I wouldn't have minded but then we would have needed to get another hire car and then would have needed to find accommodation for the night. Uh, yeah. Managed to book the mystery hotel on What If, ended up at the Langham and had a really comfortable bed for the night. I just kept on waking up because it was so damn hot in the room. How hot were you? It's pretty hot. Yeah, I thought I was going to melt at some point and I woke up and it was just like I'd been asleep for ages and I thought that we'd overslept the alarm. Turns out we had it and it was only like 4 a.m. and then I couldn't get back to sleep again. Philip woke up and I was playing on my phone. Oh, uh, if he woke up and I was playing on my phone and I hadn't panicked, it meant that we hadn't overslept the alarm. And then when the alarm went off, I just both leapt out of bed and got changed. I fell asleep pretty quickly though, did you? It's kind of like a knocked out and then woke up a couple of times and then woke up at four and couldn't get back to sleep. So yeah. I feel like my eyeballs are resting in my chin right now. And we're home, and I really love this car park because it has awesome lighting for selfies. Found that out the other day. Not sure what we're going to do. I'm starving now. Starving, overtired, wide awake. So glad to be home. I'll probably end the vlog here. I think we're going to drop our stuff off, sort out what we're going to have for dinner and then go to the supermarket. Holy shit, I can just smell rubbish. Must have been warm. Hey? Must have been warm down here. What? Must have been warm down here. Yeah, I just said it must have been warm down here <laughs> as soon as we open the car park door, I could just smell rubbish. I am so glad that I put everything in the dishwasher before we left, because holy crap, that would have been rank. Oh yeah, I hope that you guys have all had a great weekend and Maybe it was as adventurous as ours. <laughs> Maybe it wasn't. So you just hope you had a good one and I will see you guys in the next video. I've got one scheduled to come up on Sunday.